The Futuro Media Group is a non-profit, independent media organization led by Maria Hinojosa, an award-winning Latina trailblazer in news and investigative journalism. I created the Futuro Media Group. Our mission is to give voice to the new American mainstream. We are making, as we speak, a new America, and that's a marvelous moment in American history. We tell stories and report in-depth on issues often overlooked in the media. No Islamophobia in our country. We're going to fight back. I'm going to act as if I'm documented. I'm going to speak as if I was documented. And we train the next generation of multicultural journalists. That's a wrap, everyone. Woo! Futuro Media produces four programs. Latino USA, carried by NPR. This Peabody award-winning radio show is the longest-running Latino news and culture program on public media. I'm Maria Hinojosa, this week on Latino USA. Well, honey, don't you know, that music started creeping up into the church hymns, you know, that little dun 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 and Miss Morales and Miss Aponte and Miss Gonzalez were coming to me, Carlito, that's not church music. My dad was just like looking at me and I was like, Dad, I really want this. And he, he told the lady, my family's not documented. It's really hard for me to pay all of this. But if you want, I can come and clean bathrooms. The video starts with Jose laying face down on a green mattress. He's not moving, and the first guard that goes in puts a riot shield on Jose's back. He's still alive, but unresponsive. America by the Numbers, a PBS documentary series focused on the dramatic demographic shifts taking place in our country. This is the new America. Black, brown, Asian, LGBT, immigrants. The country is going through a major demographic shift, and the numbers show it. The face of the U.S. has changed. By 2044, we will be a majority non-white nation. Everybody's voice is important to this debate. Humanizing America for NBCNews.com a series of digital documentary shorts that deconstruct stereotypes behind the U.S. electorate. How does this form of political protest then actually move to policy change? The presidential candidates don't even mention Native Americans in their speeches. In order to get our conversation at the table, in order to be part of it, we need to actually engage and to get out and vote. I'm definitely a minority, you know, especially politically. As a Republican, it's been an uphill battle. If you're white, you're a racist, and if you're black, you're a sellout. And In the Thick, a political podcast from the perspective of a changing America. Welcome to In the Thick. This is a podcast about politics, race, and culture from a POC perspective. I'm Maria Hinojosa. And I'm Julio Ricardo Varela. We've had this almost like bouquet of bigotry. Donald Trump is never talking to black people or to Latinos. He's talking to white people about us. We're at the top of that mountain of hate, and it doesn't feel good. The ability to resist, that to me is inherently American. This is our moment right now to really show this country that we deserve to be here as well. I have the heart of an act. I don't believe in compromise. I believe in pushing for justice. Damn right I'm American. I'll be damned if I let anyone ever take that away from me. Our programs reach over 4 million people a year on radio, on television, online, and on social media. Our civic engagement events foster critical community dialogue. I wanted to drop out of school at a, at a time in my life because I wasn't doing well. High school and college teachers nationwide use our reporting in the classroom. Our internships and fellowships prepare young journalists for the new millennium. And we help shape the national conversation. Illegals is not a noun. An illegal immigrant, I'll use it then as an adjective. You can say it is an immigrant living illegally or an immigrant living without papers or without documents in this country. But what you cannot do is to label a person illegal. To keep bringing you these diverse voices, we need your help. The Futuro matters, now more than ever. Please make a contribution at futuromediagroup.org. And thank you.